What is up, you bunch of savages? I got another new theme park to me today. And does anybody recognize that? You can probably look through there and read it. Stop cheating. And you probably looked at the title as well. Kentucky Kingdom. This is the first for me. We're about to go in here and see what it's all about. There is an arm seat and some, uh, something else is meant to wreck the crap out of me. And I can't wait to find out what that is and ride it once and be done with it. Anyway, let's get in here. Come on with us. I see Six Flags. But well, we're not at the Six Flags. There's the, and there's the low flying planes right there. And check it out. You got a Harlem Globetrotters right here, man. Kentucky Kingdom. Who are their sponsors? Pepsi and Kroger. Crisscross Toss over here. Casa Mia Italian, heck yeah. And before we get this thing started, if this is your first time here because you are this is your home park, Kentucky Kingdom, or any park near that I've gone to. Then go ahead and please consider giving me a subscribe, please, and a thumbs up, and a positive comment. I'll try to respond and all that. But yeah, let's uh, check out your park if this is your home park. There's Frog Blog and a Drop Chowa. There's Breakdance. Breakdance and ding, 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 ding. Break out. Ding, 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 ding. Okay, maybe not. Oh, well that little kid just cursed. Your mom's not gonna be happy with you. Coasty coaster to going up. Hey, hey, hey. Lightning run, that one's called. Let's do lightning run. Is that our first one? Yeah. Ho, 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 ho. There it goes, man. I was walking along down this way and I was like, hey, let's check out the scenery while we're on our way to the entrance of Lightning Run, but boom, here it is right here. Looking at restaurants, they, I'll have to show you in a little bit, but they've actually got a Taco Bell here. They've got old timey cars too. I just learned that this used to be a Six Flags. I made a joke about the Six Flags up front, but it used to be. It used to be a Six Flags Kentucky Kingdom. And now it's just Kentucky Kingdom. But they still kept the flags up front, but anyway. Oh, interesting. I'm learning stuff. Now you are too. Right in between here, there is a road. I don't know if it's to do with the park or if it's a public road or whatever, but then there's the walkway that you use to get across to that side of the park. Line jumpers will be ejected. They don't eject you from the park, they just put you in the coaster, they undo your restraints so that ejector hill, boom, you're gone. So this right here, I said they're screaming. They're screaming like they didn't know what, like they didn't look at it before they got on it. Like, why does it do this? Pay attention next time. Before you board, for your safety and the safety of others, you must place all loose articles such as phones, hats, cameras, lanyards, and the storage bins provided, or leave them with a non-rider. Enjoy your ride. And they decided, and they know how to beautify the park. Some lovely uh, flowers along there. So the water park is also situated in between. Apparently, you have to walk through there to get through to the other ride. remember the name lightning bolt lightning so rod chance. lightning run all right dude that that was actually it was a lot smoother than i thought it was going to be but those last bunny hill things boy they re-injured my thigh from still vengeance yikes but that was a fun one we chuckled throughout so that made it fun 
Bluegrass Bakery, heck yeah. And there's a Taco Bell. Well, there's a sign for it anyway. We're gonna take the bridge. I had a choice between bridge and street and I chose the right way. Let's go! And you get all these things. Look at them. Whatever, I'm not gonna read them because I can't read. There's just a whole lot of kitty stuff over here. As you can see. There's a stage six. Is that that 5D cinema thing that we're gonna have to check out? I like 5D. We're going across the bridge. And they've got the cars over here. All right, let's see what's across the bridge. It's water park, actually. Hear me? Better put my phone down. There'll be a whole lot of naked folks. It'll be like, stop it, I'm trying to be naked. You can see the cars down there, hey, hey. Some of them are parked, all right. There's the parking lot. Of course, no more, no empty parking spaces, dang it. That's the one we just did. And going across the street on this and well, stuff. There's some kind of a board and walky thing. I think that goes to the Ferris wheel there. Here's where you go to see if your mouth is pretty and hear banjo music. Slippery when wet. Ooh, they're playing Bon Jovi. That's not Bon Jovi. I mean, dude, we're properly at a water park now. There's this awesome island right there, which is cool. And then we go through the water park to get to the coasters. Yep, we're going. That's one of them right there, the Woody up there. Woohoo! And they got Swamp Water Jacks. Uh oh. No more water. Look at this kitty ride. They're totally getting them ready for traffic whenever they start driving. <laughs> There's like no room between cars at all. Dude, all right. It's probably going to be rough as hell, but we're going to give it a go. Notable moments in history. From 1884 all the way to 2014. Dang, that's a lot of history. King Daka. Oh, Magnum XL 200. The first, right here, the first coaster to ever kill a person. No, I'm kidding. I made that up. American coaster enthusiast. I'm a member. I'm a member. Let's see if we can get on roller skater. Come on, come on, come on. There's their rapid ride. Oh, no, that's just a. Oh, never mind. I'm, I'm wrong. Dude, this looks proper old. Listen to it as well. It's all off key and all. Dude, I want to ride the elephant, of course. Wow, look at that. Coney Island, New York. Does this actually come from Coney Island? Because it uh, has all the New York stuff. Herschel Spielman Company. This looks proper old. Oh no, the ride is all clogged up. What are we gonna do? <laughs> Give me my phone. <laughs> uh oh. Y'all got through into the flowers because I made that stupid clog joke. The ride's all clogged up because it's clogged. Get it? No. <laughs> Thunder Run entrance. Right here. Oh, I missed it. Thunder Run. What are they saying on the speaker? Apparently one of Charlie Brown's old teachers got a job while running this ride. Wow. Dude, that house looks like I built it. My gosh. Alright, so we just rode the Woody. I'm talking about just rode the Woody because I'm still on the station. Oh, uh, that was Thunder Run, and the other one was Lightning Run. Anyway, wow. I was like, oh no, dude, this is gonna wreck, it's gonna wreck me because, well, not wreck me, but I'm gonna feel it. It's gonna be rough because it's a Woody, and it did not fail me. It was rather rough. When I come off of it, my back is itching. <laughs> you know, dude, that's crazy talk. So, yeah, I don't know if I need to do that again. I might do it just for the heck of it because it's fun, but there's a few parts where it's like, look, 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 it really jars you, man. But while we were up there, we saw the RMC. It looks beautiful. And another Woody back. 
Another Woody, I think? Anyway, I'll let you know. You just stay right there. I don't think that's a natural form of creep. It's 100% natural. Oh, okay. You see how water is running? Oh, you know what? And rocks are natural. I mean, that makes sense. If I hadn't written it before, I would have said, is that guy screaming because he likes it or because he wants off of it? No, no. Geyser. And they got a Larson Looper. Oh my gosh. I'd rather ride the geyser. Dude, this is terrible. They're helping me make my decisions. I was thinking to my, me and Monkey, we should start landscaping business. And they tell me to stay out of it. Oh, all right. Well, I'm going to figure out another business you to do. You know what? There's the terrible Larson Looper right by the RMC. The Razy Liver. The Razy Liver. Oh, I hate liver. What am I talking about? There's like all these tubes where nobody attached to them at all, but look, they have a lovely waterfall, bro. That looks all right. I like that. This is gonna be the death machine right here. Yikes. But before that, we're gonna eat so I can deliberately throw up on it. Because it deserves it. I've already watched videos about it and apparently it's pretty bad, so yikes. All right, so apparently the T3 is down at the moment, so we're gonna go ahead and hit over here. This is the food joint, and then we're gonna come back and give it to go. Hopefully, it'll be running by the time we finish eating. Ooh, that's another Woody. While we're over here at the taco place, finding out that it's closed completely. Okay, we were directed to this place, apparently, I think. It's got food. One of these. Anyway, we'll figure it out when we get there. All right, so I'm over here, and this is the food choices. We've got uh, burgers and tenders here, pizza there, hot, and top dogs here, so I'm in the pizza line. Super Savage is over there getting burger. And over here, if you can hear it, they've got the Harlem Globetrotters are doing their thing. Pretty cool. It's like 2.30, so they must have just done one. So I have to check the four o'clock one. It's pretty cool. Just got some lunch. I got me a flatbread pizza, which out of cheeseburgers, corny dogs, hot dogs, and other things, is actually the cheapest thing on the menu. Not that I care about it. You know, but it is kind of nice. Um, and I will give it to go. And um, I won't let you know. <laughs> Actually, I could. Hold up. All right, now I know why it's the cheapest thing. I think that's what, the kid that was on my flight. Anyway, now I know why it was the cheapest thing. Anyway, I'm gonna go eat. Y'all shut up. There's the test seat for the Kentucky Flyer. There goes the sky catcher. Catch some sky, y'all. We're gonna go catch some wood or whatever. So check out this poster right here. It's got, got a bit of coasters and water stuff and right in the middle of it, ish, there is a plane flying right through it all. Because of the airport being close by. In a plane, this one is the something flyer and it's got a uh, well, propeller on front of it. This side out there says the line jumpers will be ejected. Bull crap, they make you sit in timeout right there facing away from the <laughs> coaster and all the fun. So you can think about what you've done. We made it to the station, finally. All right, this is us after Kentucky Flyer. Uh, right quick, it's over, fast. <laughs> Real fast, I haven't timed it, but it can't be, it's gotta be under a minute. <laughs> It's, it is all right too. It, it felt like, and the trains are the same style as uh, the uh, switchback as EDTs in Seguin, Texas. It was kind of fun, but it, over too quick and too lo long of a wait with a run in one train. They got Rick Astley playing, and Rick rolling the crap out of us. Taco place is still closed. Oh my gosh. Terminator 3, let's go. Okay, so it's not named after Terminator 3. I'm just messing around. But it felt like some kind of an apocalypse. <laughs> No, you have to wait uh, in, in the next part and see uh, or hear whatever I say about that. Of course, you're not going to see anything because they don't let us take cameras on rides at any park that's not a bush, gardens, or a sea world. Sorry. Um, but anyway, so I'll go ahead and end this one. And I appreciate you coming along and having a look. But uh, watch the next one. I don't know what else to tell you. <laughs> I'll see you on that one. Y'all say savage. Thanks for watching Savage. Mr. Like, subscribe, and share. Send money!